Hey guys, welcome to a brand new episode of Mario Kart Tour. Today we're talking about Rock Rock Mountain, trick level. Big one that you can score a lot of points on, as you can see, 29,308. We're going to be going through driver cart glider setup and how to make use of the obstacles, objects on the course. Um, so this Wario Cup's looking pretty good in terms of high scores. I reckon this could, I mean, I'm already 60k and comfortable in the group without having done any work on Calamari Desert 2 or Waluigi Pinball. Let's get into Rock Rock Mountain though. Driver setup is, you know, the obvious option is Toad at level six for me. Um, great special skill. I did make the mistake of not going in with level, raising the points cap. Uh, so make sure that you do that. He's come good on three tracks in the past like four weeks. Um, and covers, covers a fair amount of tracks for a super. Would have been higher. May have been that enough to take me up to 30,000, who knows. Uh, other options, I'd say second best, is your boom, Boomerang Bro. Boomerang Flower is going to be really good in two ways. Potentially, if you now that we've got the restart option, you can tr keep re um, quitting and going back in, quitting and going back in until you get somebody in the room with a coin box. Boomerang Flower, coin box, that's a lot of coins. Boomerang Frenzy would just destroy. You'd rack up so many points. It'd be like two coin frenzies potentially. So Boomerang Bro is a great option. There's also a section where there's like a, a circle of rings. That section you you could probably use it then as well and get in drawing all the coins. Basically a coin vacuum. Um, double bob bombs with Wario and with um, Black Yoshi. Bob bombs, are, double bob bombs will be all right, but it's not great on a level where we're flying. For a good, a good fair few portions of this level, you'll be in air. There's like some jet jump boosts and there's also where you're gliding. So that's going to be hard to get those hits. That's why I don't recommend going in with that. Uh, Red Yoshi are probably better than that with Yoshi's Egg. King Boo, again, limitations of being in air. Um, and Funky Kong with Banana Barrels. Let's not even talk about that. So Toad, by, by far the best option. Um, when it comes to Rock Rock Mountain T, the car options are pretty damn good. We've got two supers. We have DK Jumbo, which is Jumpus Plus. Uh, for me, he's level at four, four. This is a great one to have. I've uh, I've invested points cap tickets to take it to 366. It covers five levels, so it's not bad. And could take it to level six. Uh, it, no, I'm not a camp. <laughs> I thought I had tickets. I'd, it's not getting to level six. But it's a, it's higher level than all the other options. Otherwise, you've got Gold Clanky Cart. Only has Dash Panel Plus, which there are Dash Panels on this, but there's more Jump Boosts, a lot more. Then you've got Mini Turbo Boost Plus with um, Blue Bad Wagon, which is a good option for me, only at level 1. We've got Slipstream on Mac 8, not great. We've got Clackety Clark with another cart with Mini Turbo Plus and Dozer da da Dasher with Dash Panel Plus, as well as Jungle, Jingle Bells. So really, it's about whatever's highest. Um, but this is by, by far the best. There are so many jump boosts in this level that you want to get this um, over mini turbo boosts, I would say. Then when it comes to gliders, options aren't too limited in that we do have a super. We have a Waluigi wing. Only comes with bullet ball plus, so it's not great. Your swooper would work nicely with bob on plus, so it's not necessarily an awful thing in com if you've got the double bob bombs in combination with this, it could work. Mine's at level 3. Could take it to level 4, but I will not be doing that. Um, it's just not good enough special skill to invest in. We will get Bullet Bill Hanafuda if you don't have any of them and you are on Gold Pass. Bright Glider has Banana Plus, which could work nicely with your banana barrels. Um, as long as you can avoid them. And then you hit your own bananas. Green Shell Plus comes with Dragon Wings as well. That will be coming midweek in the 30 pipe option. So let's let's get into how we did it. This by no means is a perfect lap, but you know it's not a difficult one. I'd say to maintain your combo on. There are some tricky sections, but I think I think you'll be all right. So let's take this at half speed so we can talk through it. Now this this start is really difficult because you've got two options, um, and I'm going to pause it when it gets to it. So starting off. It doesn't matter where you start in this track because you've got two options. If you're in the front, obviously, you're going to get a good chance of getting a coin frenzy. If you're in the back of the back or mid-pack, you're going to get some good items, which for this second glide can be really helpful. So this third, first, first part, you've got two options. You either go down, or three options maybe, either you go down and you hit the ground straight and you hit these two coins and then you need to get a drift in, a mini turbo plus, before you hit the next ramp. So that'll take in two coins and a mini 
turbo boost. The other option is you go into the two coins, and this is not easy to pull up, pull, pull off, but you're aiming down and you lift up at this just at the right time, and you'll get extra glide time, and that'll take you enough to the, the next dash panel. So that is one way. The other option is that you go up and over, miss the coins, but you can catch a jump boost off the log and you'll get two, um, you'll get probably two two glide times by the time you get to the, the dash panel. So by far the best option is swooping down and then pulling up, but it's a lot harder to pull off. I recommend going down and turning into the coins and getting a mini turbo boost. Here, I just, I just do none of them. I mean, I maintain the glide time, but I missed all the coins. So that's what you can do at this one. That, then the next section, um, I would recommend definitely trying to go for the glide into the coin and lift up. Um, this is where you are going to need coins. In last place, it works quite nicely. You know, I've got two mushrooms here. Come through here. Unfortunately, somebody takes the coin, but I was going to get that nice glide time. So I'll land, and then I only need to use one of my mushrooms, really. Then I can release my mini turbo to get that coin. Then that coin, uh, take it. I got a slipstream. So right here, you've got another kind of choice. You either could take this jump boost and the dash panel, so that's two combos, or you hit the two cones and the dash panel. That will be three combos. So best option is going for those cones, but not always hit, easy to hit two. And jump boost will pull in a, a quite a good amount, 124 points for me. Then you t turn to the left, going over these dash panels, and get a little mini turbo there, I would usually, and then release here, then slide to the left, get a mini turbo in, and either release it midair or beforehand, and then you want to go forward into these coins. I think it's better to stay going on straight forward, but you can turn to the side at this part. You definitely want to go for these jump boosts of the first jet stream, then the second one, then set up very gently, move it to get these coins and then again another jump boost and this jump boost will be enough to take you to this first jump boost so i'll catch this one now then i can start turning, turning along these we're catching every one so far getting the coin as well then go to the far right i uh, missed the jump boost there and then you'll catch that one and that one then you can release go forward into that coin start turning to the right catch these ones Catch that coin if you get the tight enough. It's not easy to get that tight turn on there. You won't need anything to get to that point. Pull a, a mini turbo just before it, but you need to, not actually just before it, you want to wait longer than I did. So because I left it too long, when I hit the, hit the uh, ramp, I was coming out to the side. So I would recommend getting it in as quick as possible, releasing it to the side and then aiming forward. That way you'll come through those ring of coins and there's like, you hit about four or five going through it. Um, as I say, this isn't my perfect lap. It was just, it was just damn good. Um, coming down here, I would recommend. It's a little, it's a little bit annoying to try and get it. But if I turn down here, what I was aiming to do is to hit that ramp, you get a dash panel, and it also sets you up quite nicely to hit the, the cart sign, and you'll get two combos added for that. Coming down into this section again, let's see if we can do it any better this time. Aiming for the coins. Oh, and we're going to miss that coin. So, yeah, as I say, that was me trying to do that, but it's really, really difficult to pull off. Get there in time because of that glide time. Coming down to this second part, we're not going to get... Oh, yes, we, this is where we get a beautiful coin frenzy. Through This is really the most difficult section to maintain your combo, I would say, after landing. And save your item ticket for then, because that's going to be a good way of maintaining it. So coming through this section... Making better use of those coins, except for that one. I go for the... I'm nearly going for the, the, the cones. But I go for the dash panel jump boost. Switch up in terms of sides, but you can, it's just the same as the opposite. Mini turbo release. I didn't even build up the mini turbo. To the right, release. Oh, I'm holding on. It's better to release midair here. Coins, coins. This is the part where it can kill you as well though. You might want to save 19 ticket just for this if you've got that one down. Because getting these lined up can sometimes be quite tricky. And getting these two coins, then setting up nicely for that. If you just get it where it's perfectly straight and it's, it's good, you can just leave it. Coming around here again. This time not getting... Did we get struck by lightning last time? 
come around here, around the outside. I tried to turn in for the coin there, but missed it. Now here's where you really got to turn tight. Managed to get that jump boost. Yeah, just caught it. And we got coin frenzy, at like just right at the end, which our combo multiplier is already at 160. So we're getting good points. Managed to set up somewhat for that this time. Tried to aim down, didn't get down enough. <laughs> we got it, we got it, we just in time. So at 29,308 score, uh, non-stop combo. It's definitely non-stop comboable. It is just, you can see it there, there's a lot of things that I didn't take advantage of. A lot of coins missed. It's not a great run, to be honest. <laughs> Why am I showing you this? Just because I want to show up a big score and show that it is non-stop combo wobble. That is a word, by the way. I made it up. Um, 91 coins from that. Smashing my previous score of 17,061. Um, so get on it, guys. Get on it and log in a big score. Let me know what you've got down in the comments section below. Um, hopefully. Hopefully you get into Hopefully you beat me. I feel like bet better is on the horizon. Um, I do have a good setup going in that. By the way, just to kind of update on the friends request, uh, I think the reason, so the reason why it's not letting me add is because I've got 19, over 99 friend requests and I think that's crashing it. So I've changed it, the device and that doesn't make any difference. I've uninstalled it and followed all those things. So hopefully we will be hearing from support. Support soon. They did actually get back to me, but it doesn't tell you when they've sent you a message back, which is super annoying. Support. This one. Tuesday. Mm. I tried to fix this. Oh, dip. Oh, okay. Thank you for your inquiry. Regarding your request, please allow us to give some specification regarding the friend function. As you progress through the cut, point rankings and friends will be held. Friend function opens at the same time as ranking is held. Cups with rankings change weekly up to... Alright, if you exceed 49 friend applications, the older ones will be deleted. Friend application deadline is 60 days. Up to 25 friend applications can be received. If you receive more than 25 friend requests, the oldest one will be deleted. Kindly note that you already reached the maximum number of friends. Thank you for your understanding. Please what does this mean? Kindly note that you already reached the num maximum number of friends. Wait, does this mean I've got to... If I delete a friend... So if I, I don't think I can delete a friend. Oh yeah, I can. Oh no, I don't want to remove. I want to see who was at the bottom last week. Okay, so maybe if I re re remove somebody. If I remove somebody. It'll work for me. So I'm watching a previous video. Now I can see who was at the bottom was Claire Claire lots of Japanese symbols you were bottom so if we remove that maybe it will let us add now oh oh no it doesn't work it's crashed No, we'll try and fix it. We'll try and fix it. But that is all for this one. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed it and found it helpful. As I say, let me know your scores down below. That is all for this one. See you guys soon.